Okay, so we got on the uh, little island here, and now we're just gonna go explore. And there's one point that is, I'm convinced, is the highest point in Florida Keys, I think. But we'll see. Uh, I have my survival kit in my bag, and there's like a couple of campsites over on that side, and we'll see. There's a little crab. See if I can zoom in on it. <laughs> We're on this little part of the island, and here's the water, and if you see the bridge over there, that is what we're trying to get, because over there, uh, there's some cool stuff, over there, on the right side is where the big hill is, and there's like a whole bird down forest over there. So there's this old car here, and all that is left is this really rusty uh, old rear axle and front axle. No, that's, no, and this is, yeah, this is the engine. Right there. It's the engine. That's pretty cool. So now we just need to find the trail that leads from this side of the island to the other one. And here it is. It's a little overgrown. Just a little. Um, but it is, like, findable. You, you can find the trail. Okay, so right over there, that's where we were just earlier, and now we're on the little bridge here. So this used to be a shrimp farm, and these were like the wall gate things, and it like shut down a while ago because birds kept eating the shrimp. But when we get across here, all the way over there, there should be a pretty big hill. So let's get to the top of that. This is the uh, hill. It's kind of small, but I think it's the biggest hill in Florida. The, not Florida. The, the, the Florida Keys, maybe. I don't know. Definitely buildings higher, but I don't know if there's anything natural this high. Okay, so uh, this is a part of a forest that has been burnt down, as you can tell by the black rocks right here and everywhere. And here's this little, not a little, pretty long path of who knows what going all the way from over there to over there. And there's a little mound, so I think it was to stop the spreading of the fire or something, but I don't know. But this whole area, a couple years ago, was just burnt down trees. And they were standing up, so they all got cut or broken down now. That's pretty cool. I feel like today's video was kind of short, kind of pointless, but uh, yeah. Ended off with a nice little fire. Um, that's nice. And uh, one more thing we're going to do. Should be kind of cool, but uh, yeah, let's get right into it. Okay, so I picked up these things for a couple bucks uh, at the uh, local grocery store. They're like little tiny smoke bombs. And uh, I think if I put it in this log right here and light it, then it's going to look kind of cool. Yeah. So. Okay, <sighs> ready? Set. Go. Hello? Whoa! I'd give that one a 9 out of 10. Because each of those costs about a quarter. So, that was worth it. Well, uh, see you in the next episode. Then. Yeah. There's this upside down boat on Marquesa Key. Oh, uh, do you stop to see that? Anyway, I kind of wanted to check it out, so...
to the front, I think. It's a blue ocean dive boat. Can you see anything? Inside? Oh, I can't really see anything. So we are on top of this boat right here, and I kind of want to see what's down here. This right here, uh, these right, these things are what used to be the propellers uh, and the shafts that went through. And there's a little tiny door right here, which I'm going to put the camera through and see if you guys can see anything inside. So this is the top of the boat, and that's the propellers. And on the side, there's a little door where the uh, divers used to go. And I have this flashlight, and uh, let's see what's inside. Okay, so far I see a bunch of dangling wires, which is not very good. Well, the flashlight's not really working, but you get the point. Uh, I don't know if you guys can see very well, but <laughs> not much interesting inside, just some old stuff. So, yeah, let's uh, well, let's see what it's called. Okay, we are on top, and let's head over to the back of the boat. Right over here. And there is a name on the side of the boat right about here. So, Live Shop LTD. What? Live Shop LTD. Huh. Well, let's go on to the next one.